Okay, today we're cleaning some probes. Dosing probes, an alt probe reader there and a pH reader. This is connected to a Astral Roller Cam system. Very similar to the Astral EQ systems. Over time, these probes get a little build up of sediment on them and they won't be able to read the correct measurement in the water. In this case here, as per the manufacturer's guidelines and recommendations, we're using a standard cream cleanser with an old toothbrush. We all have them lying around the house. You want to get in all the little nooks and crannies of these probes, don't be too hard on them. If you don't have a roller cam or an EQ system, uh, most systems are very similar. I have used this on a Haywood system before. Always check the manufacturer's guidelines or what they recommend. Very expensive uh, piece of equipment. If you damage or crack it or you're too hard on it. Always ensure you rinse the probe with some fresh water. Nice and shiny, that's the way you want it. This one here, you can see quite a bit of sediment build up on the yellow glass tip. More cream cleanser. I just use a basic cleanser. I don't use anything with any fragrances. You just want to keep it simple. Same process, rinse it off. Once this process is completed, you basically want to put them back in. If they're still not reading, check the manufacturer's guidelines recommendations. Make sure you get the correct calibration solution. Otherwise, please save yourself some time and headaches and get a correct technician, local guy to come around and do these correctly. It will save you money in the long term. If you like this type of content, want to see some more, make sure you leave it in the comments. Like the video if you found it interesting, make sure you subscribe so that way you can see any future videos coming up. Don't over tighten these, you will crack the glass inside the probes and uh, like I said before, they're quite expensive. Give the probes a bit of a rinse off. Thanks for watching, enjoy your day and stay safe.